explaining how important it wasn't to think about the Michigan State win, but think about how on the road against Ohio State, they started slow but recovered. That's Carson Edwards' range. In fact, any time he crosses half court. Yes, he's a tempo setter for the Penn State offense. More of a playmaker, not really known for scoring. Edwards again gets the soft touch. Could be one of those nights. And here is Eastern on the push, finding Klein. Edwards again from up top, bringing it home. How about this? Carson Edwards, a perfect three for three from three. And when you're a scorer, the ball will find you, Lisa, and it found him back in the corner for a knockdown three. Well, Edwards is feeling it a little bit, only missed one shot. That is his fourth. And Ryan Klein has been shooting the ball well of lately. 24-46. With his recent surge. Edwards with the rip and fire. And he is on fire. He can pull that up on the iPad. Baseline take. The first two try there for Carson Edwards. It was a gray area when he let that fly between one second and nothing left on the shot clock. Edwards responds. It's his six. When you have a 7-3 Matt Harms, he's going to make those type of shots difficult. Edwards for two. He gets the soft touch. He's got 22 in the game. Edwards thought about it. The tight closeout from Reeve doesn't matter. He has tied a career high. Go ahead, Carson Edwards. Good decisions. You have your offensive player going downhill in transition with a nice crossover and a finish at the rack. Backdoor look. Edwards had everyone falling in the air. Count the bucket. You're Penn State. You have to double team and make somebody else score. Edwards taking it all the way in, and we're tied at 85. Matt Painter calls his final timeout. Klein, who's already got six three-point makes. Edwards throws it up. Special! My goodness! What a show he's putting on! That was an unbelievable shot. The recognition to draw a foul, but I question whether it was really a foul or not. The official makes that call. The sideline or slot.